This morning, a somber service held for four year old Liliana Murdy, one of three siblings who police believe was drowned by their own mother at a Coney Island beach last week. News 12's Mary Lynn Buckley joins us from Flatlands as friends and family of little Liliana say their final goodbyes. Four year old Liliana Murdy's body laid to rest today. The women in her life carried her casket out of Carib Funeral Home and released balloons in her memory as they said one last goodbye. We love you, Her father, Shamir Small, told us Liliana was his little princess. Please remember my daughter not for how she left, but how she stayed. And who Liliana was was a four-year-old princess who loved dressing up in different costumes. Small is also the father of seven-year-old Zachary Murdy, Liliana's older brother. He held back tears and told us his children were loved so much. Four families are crying and mourning and something like this should never have happened. I wish it seemed like a dream. I wish it didn't happen. Every day I wake up tired that this is reality. A memorial now stands feet from where the bodies of Liliana and her two brothers, Zachary and Oliver, who was only three months old, were found washed up on the shoreline near West 35th Street early Monday morning. The children's mother is 30 year old Erin Murdy. She now faces multiple murder charges for the deaths of her young children, including intentional murder murder with depraved indifference and murdering victims under the age of 11 in each of her children's deaths. The pastor at Liliana's funeral mass and even small speaking of Murdy today. I mean, this is a situation which no one could fathom. No one can understand. Um, but I do believe that it is our responsibility, at least myself as a pastor, um, to pray for everyone and anyone. When you think of Lily, her brother Zachary, her brother Oliver, when you see them, see pictures or anything, remember them for who they are. They're a three-month-old baby, a seven-year-old who are loved by their fathers, despite what anything have happened to them. And yes, their mother did love them, despite what she have done. Her family tells us Liliana's body will be buried in Cypress Hill Cemetery. They say she was a cheerful, happy little girl who will be missed each day. In Flatlands, Mary Lynn Buckley, News 12.